Um, I wanted to play basketball, play basketball with my friends, go to school, just be a normal kid. And I was kind of sad. Christopher has osteosarcoma, which is a specific kind of bone cancer that is relatively resistant to radiation. I came home from work and uh, he was home with Chris. There were mentions of cancer. At that point, I just didn't want to know anymore. It, it felt sort of, I don't know, unfair. It's like, why would this happen to him? I mean, he's so active, he's so excited. Why, why would this happen to my little brother? Christopher ended up being a candidate for the Van S rotation plasty procedure, which is actually such a complex and rare procedure that it's only performed at a few hospital systems around the country. Kaiser Permanente selected to work with Stanford on this procedure because it would give him the best chance for a long-term uh, positive outcome. My favorite sport is basketball, and that was the one that allowed me to be the most active. When there's a question of a leg versus a life, the leg becomes irrelevant. That means a rotation plasty where the ankle is converted into a knee joint by cutting out the whole knee area and then by rotating the foot and attaching the ankle to the thigh bone. We've been in Kaiser for a long time. Our experience was not just one of professional expertise that treated an illness. These were human beings that were treating our family. He's completed the therapy with no evidence of disease anywhere. He's at the point now where he's doing well enough that physical therapy is actually starting to back off and just uh, let him live his own life. He's alive and he's healthy and all the test returns are back as good as they can be. The most exciting part of my job um, is actually seeing the kids like Christopher actually back out there living their lives. We are still here today together as a family and we couldn't be more grateful. I mean, they, they saved his life. He is running and jumping and playing and I don't know that there are words that I could say that would truly express um, how thankful. I can shoot, I can dribble around. I can do anything now that I could before I was diagnosed.